Hello everyone, hope you all are well. Welcome to Future Proof Accountants. Today I'd like to show you two reports that I would highly, highly recommend you to add as part of your end of month if you're using XPM as your practice management system and Blue Zero as your accounting system. There's obviously more and more numbers that you can match up, but the two numbers that I would highly recommend um, matching up between the two systems are going to be one report. You go to your profit and loss, get your monthly, whatever the sales number is. That number should match up with the revenue in Green Zero. And we'll quickly touch on the report, um, which we need to add uh, match it up against. The other report is your age receivable. Matching up age receivable in Blue Zero against Green Zero will ensure that the payments that came in Blue Zero got marked off in Green Zero. That should be an automated process. But if it is not matching, it's the best way to check those things on a monthly basis. That way you're not coming at the end of the year and the file is in complete mess. And same thing here is you want to double check your revenue for the month in Blue Zero against Green Zero. So I'm quickly going to share with you all my Green Zero screen. So we can make sure which reports should we check those two blue zero reports again. Here is the report. So aged balance report. When you click on aged balance report, you want to match that against the blue zero age receiver report. And here is your client revenue report, which will match, which should ideally match to your um, sales in your profit and loss. If they're not matching, Definitely need some investigation. You want to drill down into the detail of the report and see what's missing, why it's missing. Um, bit of forensic accounting in your own accounting would be helpful. But once it's all clean and you're all matching, do that as a process each month. And then you will have your blue zero, green zero matching all the time. And that's what we want to get to. Okay. I'll see you next time with more XPM related notes. Thanks. Bye-bye.